Welcome everybody to Cafe Owner Simulator, the second day. How's it going everyone? Welcome back. Uh, yeah, I'm glad to be back with some more Cafe Simulator, Cafe Owner Simulator. Um, <clears throat> like it says in the chat today, today, uh, let me just make a full disclosure here. In today's stream, what you're going to see in Cafe Owner Simulator is not a full, it doesn't, it's not a full representation of the game. I am playing on an older build build uh so why am i doing this a uh, little bit of a backstory here i'll be honest with you when the game fully released because when we last streamed we played this game a day early when the game fully released there was obviously like a day one update or something that that went on and it deleted everything that we had it deleted all of our save files no save file uh we couldn't get it back the only way to get it back was to actually go back to an older build so for me to continue my restaurant and my cafe, uh, the only way I could do is actually go through the older build. So that's the only way we're going to be continuing the cafe that we've had in since the last stream. So full disclosure, what you see today, uh, bugs, whether there be might be new stuff in the game or bugs in the game. Um, it's definitely not a, uh, yeah, it's not a, uh, it's not a full representation. Let's just be real here. <laughs> okay. So uh, your, your your bugs in your game might be different and all that goodness. So yeah, yeah, yeah. How's it going, everyone? Hope everyone's having a wonderful Saturday. Yeah, it is the weekend Saturday. We're only a couple weekends off before the, uh, you know, before the end of the year and, the, you know, some of the biggest holidays of the year, right? Absolutely. It's a lie. He's pre-recorded. My world is shattered. Get out of here. Jefferson is not a lie. You're pre-recorded. Hey. Hey. How you doing? How's it going, everyone? How you doing, Melissa? How are you, how you doing, geography student? Luna, what's going on? Samantha, how you doing? Game Station, how you doing? Danielle, Danielle Mumford, how you doing, Danielle? And Danielle Smith, how is it going, too? Yeah, how you doing? Grill lost his, too. This is the first that I'm hearing this. I did not know Grill lost his, too. Oh, my Lord. I wonder if he knows that he can go back on an older build like I am uh, if he wanted to finish this out. Hopefully, he does. Hopefully, someone uh, can let him know about that. <clears throat> RJ, how's it going, RJ? I clicked off uh, Cafe Sim Stream 1 of cans. Now I'll never know how it ends. <laughs> how's it going? Ava, how's it going, Ava? How you doing? Jason, what's going on? Jason, Deanna Williams. Yeah, so um, I'm going to click in here. There might be bugs today, possibly bugs. Um, you know, from just the, the pre-release, you could say. If we run into bugs, some of the bugs that we, if, I'm just saying, if we run into any bugs today, it probably is already maybe ironed out, you know, on the regular build. So, yeah, I just want to at least, like, finish off the uh, cafe. We're very close. I, it's not going to be a long stream today for cafe owner. Uh, later today, we're going to be playing some more Trader Life Simulator, too. So, we're going to do two streams today. So, you know, you know, if you got nothing else doing on a Saturday, you can hang out with all of us, hang out with me, and... Uh, Chill out as we play some freaking retail, I guess. I don't freaking know, dude. Something like that, right? How you doing, Deborah? What's going on, Deborah? How you doing, Maggie? How you doing, Maggie? Hey, Melissa. How's it going, Melissa? Grill rebuilt his? Oh, my Lord. I, you know, you know, if that's what he wanted to do, he can rebuild it, right? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I was thinking to myself, I was like, shoot. <laughs> Should I rebuild it or not? I did contemplate it, but at the same time, I was like, well, I, I kind of want to see what the end game is like. Maybe, you know, hopefully we'll have to see, right? There, I mean, I don't even know if there really is going to be like some sort of end game. Uh, really, honestly, though, this is a little bit different. What the frick are you telling me? I'm pretty sure we had orange cats. This is not an orange cat. That's a gray cat. That's a black cat. That's a Sabrina the Witch cat. Yeah, but anyways, today we wanted, you know, I wanted to see what would happen. We have 9 out of 15 soda cans sold. So let's see where the game takes us for, you know, if anything. And yeah, we'll go from there. Let's go ahead and power this up, please. Plug it in. Thank you. Now you're plugged in. Very good. Uh, there might be some wonky frames in this because, again, this is like an older... I think there's been two updates since the... There was the uh, release update, and then I believe there was another update after that as well. So, I don't know. We'll have to see. Yep, yep, yep. <clears throat> I got to the point where Kansas just got to the second floor and painted the walls in mint green. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You had to restart Trader Life Simulator too. I feel like I did something wrong. Interesting. Okay. Very well. Okay, we're still doing good up here. This is, like, probably my favorite. I mean, we have this, like, little bit of, like... It, we're going to expand out here in a bit. But this is, like, my favorite part of the cafe, obviously, right? I don't know. <laughs> I think it's pretty cool. 
I thought you meant actual bugs in the coffee shop when you were talking about bugs. No, no, no. We're talking about compute bugs. Yeah, not actual bugs. <laughs> All right. So let's go ahead and run the uh, run the shop. Let's open it up. Well, actually, I mean, we have $155. Is there anything we need to kind of like restore? Uh, maybe. Maybe. Possibly. Possibly not. You know what? Let's just take a look. Okay. Yeah, there is. What the heck is this? Uh, what, what is that? I don't know what that is. If you bought a box of groceries by mistake or you don't need it anymore, you can throw it in the large trash bag or trash can in the back of the restaurant. Oh, okay. Are you suggesting that I made a mistake? <laughs> and then the dough. Okay. All right. Wait a sec. Does that really cost $5? Fourteen dollars? Five? Yeah, okay, that really did cost five dollars. Okay, nice. Yeah, why are the cats orange and not black? I I don't know. Or why are the cat? Yeah, why are they black this time? I have no idea. I don't know. Hey, not given. How you doing, not given? Open up. Thank you. I don't know, no ginger cat. What, what happened there? Oh, but this guy's back. Look at him. Oh yeah, one thing we still need to do today is uh, we need to uh, take a picture of the Bigfoot, Sasquatch, get money that way, yeah? We still got to do that. So that's something I still want to do as well. Serendipity, how you doing, Serendipity? How's it going? Be lurking and rapping. Oh, that's a new one there. Lurking and rapping Christmas gifts. Yeah, 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 I like that. That's pretty good. That's pretty good indeed. Uh, daily f uh, only Fantas, not only fans, but only Fantas, sorry. Put that in there. I think we are already stocked up on everything, right? Yeah, we have our only Fantas. We have our blue cow. Very well. Very well. Okay, so I think we're ready to go. Uh, as far as food, I think we're just fine. We have good capacity throughout here, right? We don't sell hamburgers. This is not a hamburger joint yet. I could turn it into a hamburger joint. It's not that quite yet. All right, let's open. 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 There we go. Open. Yeah, so w there has been a lot of updates. Uh, like a, there's been, I, like I said, two updates since uh, since we last played. There's been some AI pathing. There's been a lot of actually good uh, quality of life updates that have happened in this game. We won't get to experience them today, which I'm a little bit sad. But uh, that, you know, that's all right. Who knows? Maybe in the future we'll, we'll take another run at this game, uh, you know, and all that good stuff. When, when they will make Internet Cafe? Uh, what? What do you mean? When will they make Internet Cafe? You mean like the game Internet Cafe? Like Internet Cafe 1 and 2? Are you saying when will they make that? I, I do not know. <laughs> I don't know if they're going to make another one or not. Or are you talking about in this game? I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, 9 out of 15. So just sell 6. Oh, don't tell me garbage. I know about the garbage. I know about the garbage. Trust me. I'm very familiar with the garbage. And I... Oh, you son of a gun. Not this again. No, 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 no. Look, look here. I forgot the tool wheel. Oh, no. I forgot the tool wheel. Is it tool? R? No. Tablet? F. That's what it is. F. Not like F as in F. But yeah, F. <clears throat> please. Please stop it. Thank you. That's a freaking noise, isn't that not? Hey, Yoga, how you doing, Yoga? How's it going? You missed the vids? Well, I... I missed you. <laughs> All right. So she she's happy she comes in and what, she buys something from here? <gasps> Ooh. And then she like what she takes a she has something in her hand. Does she just go up here? Oh, she does. Okay, so she actually bought something from below, and she says, "You know what? I'm gonna go sit upstairs in the patio." Oh, very good. Oh, good for her. Good for her. Okay. All right. Nice. We gotta make some money. We gotta make some money flat out. We do have a cleaner. Hopefully, outside. Yeah, he's just chilling. He's waiting. He's waiting for his time. We'll pet the cat. Okay, we will not. There we go. As I say, we'll we'll pet the cat. Do that for sure. Mm -mm. Ooh, restaurant rating. I feel like we're going through all this again. 
Uh, the wait a sec. Actually, this is a, with the stars, right? The rating of your restaurant is the most important indicator. It is displayed at the top of the screen as stars. The more stars, the more customers will visit. To increase your rating, keep it clean. Periodically make repairs, serve customers faster. The longer they wait at the cash register, the lower the rating they will uh, they will leave. Okay. The tastier the coffee, the higher the rating, and much more. Maintain comfort. Uh, the more comfort items in your establishment, the higher the comfort. Good luck. Okay, very well. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Footprints were very... Okay, it's giving us like a full tutorial all over again, I think. That's all right. Oh, I got this. I got I got the trash can. Give me the trash. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Give me the trash. Give me the trash. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Give me the tip as well. Also, thank you. Yeah. So, we taken out the jukebox... Right? I think the jukebox is completely gone. Yeah, the jukebox is completely gone because I tried my best last time we played. I did. I tried my best the last time we played to, like, sing over the jukebox. I got hit. I got hit with the copyright, of course, right? Go figure. It felt good. <laughs> so, I'm not bringing that son of a gun back. <laughs> it is what it is. Now, that could have been fixed by the time their new updates have came out, but yeah. <laughs> Hey, Queen, how you doing? How you doing, Queen? <laughs> Have a good one, RJ. Have a good one. Hey, Crystal. What's going on, Crystal? I absolutely love your streams. I watch it a lot. Oh, very good. Oh, very good. I'm glad to hear that. Thanks, Crystal. Hey, Charlie. How you doing, Charlie? <laughs> How's it going? Oh, what is that noise? They're like, what the heck? Wow. There's like sound effects of like people in a restaurant. I'm like hearing new things, man. I got to go upstairs and check to see if there's any like coffee. Make sure we got that brew. Make sure we got the pastries going as well. If we need to bake something, we'll bake something. How you doing, Susan? What's going on, Susan? Uh, Let's see here. Let's go with there and see if we have all this good. Uh, five, thirteen, three. We could make probably more cheesecakes. Maybe. That's in the shelf. This is in the refrigerator. Okay. Wait a sec. So if you take the tray out and we say, uh, put, fill the tray with cheesecakes. Okay, we don't have enough cheesecakes. Okay, in shelf. Okay, that's in the shelf. This is in the refrigerator. We have zero cheesecakes in the refrigerator. Okay, so let's buy a few of those. Maybe like 10. And then, like, uh, 10 eclairs? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we'll go cheesecakes. Fill it with cheesecakes. That's good. That's good. That's good. Yeah, we're very, we're very, oh, we need to, yeah, let's actually turn that on. Can we turn that on? Exterior, exterior, exterior. My restaurant. Just to make sure this is on. There we go. Turn on the lights, please. We're almost at level nine. Oh, yeah. Well, there we are. We're at level nine. <laughs> we can actually now uh, change more of the colors on the exterior. I'm actually kind of interested in that. How many soda cans we need? Two more soda cans and we're good? Two more soda cans. That's it. Mm -mm. You're not Crystal, but you're her husband, Bobby. Oh, very well. Very well. How you doing, Bobby? How's it going? Mm -mm -mm -mm. Hey, Alexandria. What's going on? Let me see here. Let me see here. Dare I do a purple? Ooh. It's like a midnight. Oh my god, I got six thousand dollars, sixty-six hundred dollars now. Uh, that's kind of spicy. That feels good. Yeah, that's really good. I just looked up on Steam and was pleasantly surprised. This game has a free prologue to check out. Oh, very good. Yeah, if it has a free prologue, yeah, take the take the demo for a ride. Absolutely. Why not? I will take care. No, I don't need to take care of it. Do I need to take care of it? I think I might. Our cleaner's not doing his cleaning job. Maybe I don't know. Let's. You know, I got this. Don't worry about it, pal. I guess so. Um, a new skill. Yeah, let's see. Uh, the only thing we can really afford is utility bills, but I'm not really going to benefit from that right now. We don't need to use it on the utility bills. I got to think of what I'm going to actually spend my $6,000 on. I mean, of course, possibly this. Expand second floor. That would be $9,000. I'm going to see what happens when we get 15 uh, soda cans sold first. And then we'll go from there. And then maybe I'll get, like, more money when I get that quest completed, too. <clears throat> yep. Mm -mm -mm. 
who hasn't started their Christmas shopping yet like me. I need to, like, find somebody. I gotta go find somebody to, like, wrap a Christmas gift. Yeah, if you watch the members video, you know what I'm talking about. It's a very tiny little gift, right? It's a very tiny little gift, but I... I I, I, I was thinking about getting it wrapped nice or maybe just go and do my attempt at how small it is. But at the same time, I don't want to get caught as well. You know? Uh, excuse me. Shut the door. We got to make sure our employees are happy. Management. Yep. Uh, premium. Premium, 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 premium. I might get new new people, maybe. Let's see. Let's pay a headhunter just to see. You. Uh, no. Nothing good there. Here comes the Cessna, coming in. Yep. There it goes. Very good. I will grab my tip and leave. I'm waiting for the Bigfoot to come. He's not out there, is he? No, he's not out there. He's just chilling. Task completed. All right, so we did it. So we actually got the sodas done. So now it says reviews of your cafe are an important part of the success. Of your restaurant business uh reach level eight unlock the ability to see reviews okay we've done that bam hey it's sheriff dries owens i see things are going well i'm very happy since you're new to our area i want to let you know that every year we have a fast food festival wait i feel like we've seen this so get pizza burgers and sushi on your menu and be ready for the big influx on people. Best of luck. So those are something we don't have. We don't have burgers. We don't have sushi because, you know, we felt like that was weird. But I guess we'll, we'll still have to do it. So sell 15 pizzas to customers to earn $300 and participation award. I'm pretty sure we're selling pizza now. Let me just double check and pay my bills. I'm pretty sure we are. Are we selling pizza? Oh, yeah, we're selling pizza. Absolutely, we're selling pizza. We're not selling the country pizza. and We're not selling the carbonara pizza. But I'm kind of tempted to, like, throw those on real quick. A uh, lot more burgers. There's some sushi. And when I close the shop, because I can't add, I can't really buy. I don't think I can buy ingredients or add anything until the shop is closed. Let me double check here. Whoops. Yeah, I don't think I can add anything to the menu until the shop is closed. It says click and drag, but who knows? I think we're okay. Well, at least we have pizza on the menu, so we can at least sell those. 15 of them, $300 participation award. I w would, whoa, your shirt looked pretty fancy there. I wish I could get like a $300 participation award. That'd be kind of sick. I'm going to sweep that, no problem. Grab a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. And then we'll, we'll see what we have uh, going on for us. How's it going, Queen Zelda? How you doing? I'm excited to play this game, but trying to acquire new items in Dinkum. Yeah, I'm a, I, we have the Dinkum stream coming tomorrow. I'm a little nervous, I'll be real with you, because, you know, getting the items. The cool update, cool items is always fun, but it's always hard getting the items for sure, right? Absolutely. I think you're out of Sprite. Let me check. Am I out of Sprite? Did I run out of the Sprite, baby? I am. I'm out of the Sprite. Good, good eye. Very good eye. I can order that, right? you damn right. Place it in. Fill it up. There we go. Hey-o. Hey, Darren. How you doing, Darren? Good to see you. Hope you're doing well. I'm letting my wife handle Christmas. I'm just a bartender and married, so I have no money. <laughs> hey, Ween. How you doing, Ween? I'm about ready to just do gift cards for everyone. No wrapping involved. Eh, yeah, there you go. Put them in a little, like, card or an envelope, maybe. I don't know. Right? Hey, Kayam, how you doing, Kayam? There's, like, some families you got to watch out for. Like, there's there's types of families where they're like, hey, this is really cool uh, for you to get me a gift. Like, don't, like, when it comes to gifts, right? Like, isn't it, I don't know, I find it kind of, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm weird, right? Maybe I'm weird. Well, well we, we can actually get past that part. But there's, like, there's some people that, like, you buy gifts for, right? And they're like, oh, this is so cool. Thank you so much. And then you're like, yeah, no problem. And they're like, yeah, is there, do you have the receipt to this? What? Yeah, do you have the receipt to this? Um, I mean, yeah. They're like, oh, okay. And they just sit there and stare at you. And then you're like, oh, did I give you my receipt for it? I have people in families and friends where they will like say, thank you for, thank you so much for the gift. But I'm going to go return it. Now, this is a very common thing, though. 
and I don't think a lot of people know about it, right? I think there's a there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of return gifters or return receivers out there. That makes sense. <laughs> return receivers. I don't know. What what really grinds your gears, right? I know. What really grinds your gears? I was looking for the homeless guy. I started hearing him talk. Started to hear him talk and nothing came through. Uh, give me this. Nope. And give me that. Thank you. $9,000 is going to be a son of a gun. I tell you what. This is done though. Yeah. Uh, start baking. I didn't. How <laughs> there's going to be someone in the freaking replay that's like, you didn't start the banking process. My bad. I got it going though. It's going now. City Legends. Hi, this is Sheriff Dries Owens. Did you hear the news about the horrible monster that's roaming around? Oh, yeah, we already know about the Bigfoot, dude. Don't even get me started. We know everything about the Bigfoot. I would like to take a picture of the Bigfoot. When I see the Bigfoot, I'm pulling out the camera. Yep. I forgot to do Elf on the Shelf so far in December, and today my daughter looked at me and asked so sad if he has forgotten her. Damn near broke my heart. Oh, my Lord. Dude, if you'll get the Elf on the Shelf coming back, you absolutely better make it like a incredible like comeback like something crazy like maybe a dish or maybe a couch goes through the window <laughs> no let's not do that again how about that <laughs> let's not let not let's not let the elf do that <laughs> no 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 let's not do that let's get it going Greetings, this is the Irish Pub. Greetings, our company in the, is in the business of restoring vintage bars and pubs. We have one very cool pub to restore. We hear you are a master of your craft. Restore this legendary pub. We will generously pay you for your work. $6,000, new furniture, new logo, six, sorry, 700 XP. Let's get it going. Let's go see this Irish Pub, baby. Yeah. I'd rather give, the re I'd rather give than receive, honestly. Yeah, I know, too. Danielle's the same way. Danielle's like, I'm very, like, awkward when people give me gifts and they're, like, they're sitting, like, there, there. You know? There. There we go. Here, here's your gift. And then you, you take the gift and you start to, like, unwrap it. I'm the kind of person that, like, goes from the corners, goes from the edges. I'm not the kind of person that just gets into there. I, like, unwrap the gift wrap. Like, I'm going to save the gift wrap, even though I'm not really going to save the gift wrapping paper. You know what I mean? I take my time, I stroke it out, right? And then they just stare at you. It used to be very cool, cool bub, but then there was a fire. Now the new owners want to bring bring it back to life. Take out all the trash, restore everything that's broken, create an <laughs> interior and decor suitable for an Irish pub. Uh, P.S. This pub is added to the game as an almost perfect copy of the pub, Corzo Pub in Viv, Ukraine. This is, wait, this is a pub actually based off of Ukraine? That's kind of sick. A real life uh, location, possibly? Who knows? I'm interested, though. Just take these out. Just, just get, just take this out. Just get, get it going. Oh, there's a can. Oh, well, $160. Thank you. We'll go. First, we'll go money, and then we'll go... Oh, cans with reward. We'll go money, and then we'll go, uh, like, I don't know. You know. <laughs> we'll go We'll go broom after. We'll go broom after. Sorry, money, trash. Thank you. Early morning. Sorry. Apologize. Brain's still trying to work. My bad. eBay is covered in gifts people sell after Christmas. I saw in my local news today, uh, there was this old woman on the news this morning. And she wanted to uh, politely remind everybody in the community that there are people scamming people on the internet. She was scammed out of $500 twice. And she had to uh, make sure that she came onto the news this morning to um, let people know that there's scammers out there. Twice scammed $500. Twice. Twice. <sighs> yeah twice am i painting oh i am painting that's kind of cool really like to not buy gifts and just have our family take a nice vacation i'm right there with you i feel you on that one 
I feel you on that one. People that say that Hawaii is not a winter destination, it's a damn lie. Hawaii is a winter destination. How's it going, Res Fox? What's going on? I keep my wife awake at night because I'm always watching your videos. Oh my lord. I hope I'm not yelling too much or saying awful things <laughs> or talking about nonsense. Be like, hey, wake up. Has to be even bigger than the elf fart in the jar. <laughs> <laughs> Early morning, it's almost 2 in the afternoon. No, it's not. Not for me. Maybe for you it is. Not for me. Hey, Sarah. How you doing, Sarah? How you doing, Sierra? How's it going? Been really excited to, to see this one. So glad you were able to restore the file. Yeah, I'm very excited that I got to restore the file, too. It does suck that I'm not on the, like, the latest patch. But, you know, at least I got my save back. That's what matters the most. Yeah, I got my save back. I'm good. I'm happy with that. I can continue, you know, so that that's nice. I'm glad I was able to uh, uh, fully restore it. Mm -mm -mm. Why can't I do the corners? Yeah, we got to do the corners. Uh, thank you right there. Hey, mermaid. How you doing, mermaid? Good to see you again. Hope you're doing well. Here we are. Breathe deep. What's going on? Breathe deep. Says, I found you when I started playing Dinkum. Looking forward to tomorrow's stream. Oh, very good. Yeah. Thank you. Appreciate the kind words. Yeah. Hope to see you in tomorrow's stream. Yeah, for the Dinkum freaking Dinkum. <laughs> freaking, dink freaking Dinkum update. Christmas update. Holiday update. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -mm -mm. I've been at work since 1030 this morning. Everybody's probably like, yeah, y'all are... Y'all are like probably like for the most part, for the most part, I'm assuming people are like winding down maybe. For the most part. There we go. Oh, dude, how am I going to get that? I don't know how I'm going to get that corner piece. I don't know how I'm going to get that corner piece. Let me just make sure. Brick. Can I jump on a trash bag? How am I going to get that corner piece? I don't think I'm going to be able to get that corner piece. No, no corner piece for me. There we go. No, my headset is just loud and it lay I lay next it lays next to me. <laughs> the headset going hard. Gotta love it. I need a Roku headset, one of those Roku thing in my bobbers. You know what I mean? Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. Fool me three times. F the peace sign. Can't put the blame on me? You? I don't know. <laughs> Something like that, right? Fool me once. Shame on you. Fool me twice. Shame on me. Fool me three times. F the peace sign. There's a there's a J. Cole song there. Yeah. Uh, let me go with the rake. Hey, Christina. Totally. How you doing, Christina? Smack the thumb up button. Ooh. Smack it or, like, break it. Break that thumb. You know, YouTube has an awesome, like, brand new animation when you hit the like button nowadays. So that's kind of cool. If you press it, you can see it go pretty. Do some pretty things. Hey, David. How you doing, David? It's kind of interesting having, like, a door right there. Put the windows in. Thank you. It's almost 8 p.m. here. Whew. 8 p.m. No? My lord. It's, it's, it's like 10 a.m. It's 10 a.m. where I'm at. It is 10 a.m., baby. Is this game worth it? How you doing, Chase? Is this game worth it? I played the demo, and it got a bit boring since the people took ages to get to the cafe. Um, well, it, well, hang on a second. Let me paint this real quick. It all depends. I don't know what the retail price is. Let me just say that. If anybody knows the retail price, please let me know. Um, but if you play the demo version, the prologue version, you're most likely playing a outdated uh, version of the game. So you're not going to get the full potential out of it, I guess you could say. Uh, compared to like where the game sits at now. Um, 
if I hang on a sec, if someone actually says the price of the game in chat, I'll I'll gladly give you my two piece on this. So hold that thought. <laughs> hold that thought. I kind of want to. Well, no, that would be ridiculous. I was like, I want to put the kitchen downstairs. No, that'd be stupid. Put the kitchen right there, or back here. Nineteen ninety nine. Okay, nineteen ninety nine USD. Um, if it's nineteen ninety nine USD. Would it be worth it? Ten percent off right now. I would have to say probably on an honest opinion, you could probably spend your twenty dollars, twenty USD elsewhere. Will you get twenty hours out of this? Probably not. Honestly, I don't think you're gonna get twenty hours out of this game. Uh, I think if you're really into these, uh, into this genre, I think this will be a good buy for you. If you're by curious into this genre, it might not be like everything for you. Um, your twenty dollars could be spent on like Dinkum or something, but yeah, twenty dollars. I mean, the way I see it right now, this game is a one playthrough. Once you play through it once, you don't really have a purpose to play through it again, right? Right. So yeah, it's like one of those one playthroughs. And are you gonna get twenty hours out of your first playthrough out of one playthrough? Most likely not. Go. I'm not lying about the like button. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not lying about the like button. I am not. Let me actually put a small sink there. That'll look good. There we go. I'll leave around 3 and come back and at 7 till 3 a.m. And then Sunday until noon at 3 a.m. Is there a point to petting the cats in the game apart from making them happy? Somebody told me that it had to do with um, it could help you with them catching rats more often. That's what I was told. I can't confirm that's an actual thing, but that's what I've been told and. Uh, from that, it kind of makes sense. It does make sense. So, yeah. Put the fryer right there. Other than, you know, like, cats or dope, I guess, right? This thing is so loud. Hang on a sec. Thank you. Wow, that was loud. Is the street closer to the cafe now? Because in the demo, it was really far away. This is a different... This is not our cafe. This is a uh, mission that we're doing. We're not doing this. Uh, this This is just separate. Yeah. This isn't our cafe. We're doing a job right now. But no, the the, the original cafe is um, is farther away. Ice cream machine. I kind of like the, the, the concept of like self-serving ice cream. Home down buffet. Come get your own ice cream. I'll buy it when it goes on sale better. Yeah, and there, most likely that will happen too. You'll probably the, the game will go on sale eventually, unless you're like a very like a. And I know people that are like super like uh you know they're super fans of simulators. And if you are a super fan of simulators, it it will be a good buy for you regardless. But if you're just curious about the genre, uh, you you could probably wait out wait a bit. There we go. I gotta put light in here. Light, 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 a flood light. Oh, look at that. The ceiling looks god awful. God awful. Um, let's go to complete task. No, no, no. Task panel. Thank you. Repair. There's like yeah, there's 98% repair. I'm I don't know if I'm gonna be able to like repair this thing. I feel like I need to. I don't think I'm gonna be able to repair everything here. <clears throat> hey benji how you doing they offer bundles oh okay good is there bundles with this game i wasn't sure if there was that's good uh bundles with animal shelter and a second bundle with bakery sim for 30 dollars each and a bundle with car mechanic simulator oh very good okay if there's if there's a bundle that's that's good to hear that's good to hear definitely for sure animal shelter is fun it's a very grindy game 
for sure, but it's fun. We've played that on the channel way back. I can't remember. Maybe last year, I think we played it. Um, but we played uh, Animal Shelter. We also have Car Mechanic on, on the channel briefly. Briefly. can't remember if we did Bakery Sim or not. I think we might have done a brief uh, look at it. Just like that. And then maybe one over there by the bar. Maybe like something fancy by the bar. There we go. Looks kind of cool. Looks kind of cool. Let's do walls and ceilings. Hey, James, how you doing? Go ceiling, please. I'm looking at a... Uh, I don't know what I'm looking at, actually. I was going to say like a bright... No, 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 no. Something crazy. This is a pub, after all. Yeah, I like it. This is an Irish pub, right? I believe it is. That's what it said. I think Irish pub. One thing that irks me about this game is that you have to close the cage to buy anything or make. Oh, close the close the um close the the cafe to buy anything. Yeah, yeah. I wish you could like keep that cafe open and then like buy furniture and stuff. But yeah, you can't. You definitely can't do that. Mm -hmm. Cage equals cafe. <laughs> Car mechanic sim is great. Yeah, it is. Car mechanic simulator is one of the best simulators out there, I think. There we go. You got car mechanic simulator on Xbox? Yeah, it's a good game. For sure, for sure. Oh, thank God we got that noise to stop. That's a loud noise. I kind of li like the ceiling a lot, actually. At least for an Iver Irish pub. 100% good. How am I? I'm doing good. I'm doing good as well, uh, James. Yeah. I, yeah, yeah I, so, I know. Whoa. So, like, I took two days off from streaming, which I haven't done in, I don't even know, like, in a while. I guess in, like, maybe over a month or so. So, that was, that was decent. Except for, like, one of the days off was to take Danielle to the airport, which was, like, a five-hour drive. And all together. And then, after that, for some reason, I got, like, it was the evening time. And I was like, oh, yeah, I'm kind of like, I got nothing to do. I got nobody to talk to. Uh, I, I, I can't just sit here and talk to my pigs and talk to my dogs all night. And then the doorbell rings. And the doorbell's like, hey, this is uh, UPS. And we have your brand new desk. And I'm like, frick. I'm like, I have to, I have to build it now. So I, I'm using my new desk and a lot of other new things. So today is like the first official day. So I spent like six or seven hours building my desk, building my mounts and all this. I got new mounts and things like that. And at the end of it, I was like, wow, dude, I'm exhausted. <laughs> and so yesterday I was like, maybe I'll just take that day too. And so I did. It was nice. It was nice. What did I do yesterday? uh honestly i didn't do anything i didn't do anything very productive i mean i may i schedule my streams for today but other than that like i watched my cousin Vinny and called it a day that's not exactly what i was expecting that to look like neither is that terrible also terrible Even worse? My god, these are terrible. The heck is this? That no. Classic movie? It is. Like Joe Pas uh Joe Pas Pasimi Joe Pasci Joe Pas Pesci? Joe Pesci? Man, dude. He's one I know he like rest in peace, right? He's like Oh, I like this actually. Yeah. He he's such he's he does such a good job in that movie. And then Marissa Tomain is like Marissa Tomain is just a spicy woman in that uh <laughs> in that movie. She's one hundred percent spice. I I know like there's an episode of Seinfeld where they talk about Marissa Tomain. Everything in that episode of Seinfeld is true. She's a spicy woman, and she ha has those pouty lips. 
Booby was like, you know, made in what, 1991, 1992, but that's a good movie. I've never seen My Cousin Vinny. Check it out. There we go. I kind of like the brick. Th th this is kind of bright. I wish it was kind of faded, but can I do the middle here? I'm a little irked that I can't do the middle. What the hell is that all about? Mm -mm. Let's just say if they ever ported this to the Xbox, I'd probably buy it. If they ported a lot of simulators to the Xbox, I probably would buy them as well. Yeah, I, I probably would be on the same same boat as you. Let's go downstairs and do this. Or should I make this like a dungeon? I can't do that either? What the frick? Nah, we'll keep it brick. Creep, keep, creep, not creep. Not creep. TLC. I need light down here. What's a youth? What's a youth? Oh, what's a youth? Oh, I'm sorry. Youth. <laughs> Youth. A youth. Sorry, judge. <laughs> uh. <laughs> this is kind of like... This is kind of... This is kind of like... I don't know. This is this is kind of dungeon s, but I feel like this is gonna be like where you you play games <laughs> and possibly have a drink or two. What's a youth? It's a youth. It's youth, judge. It's youth. Sorry, youth. I'm gonna go with the same ceiling. Um. Where is the ceiling, please? And thank you. No, 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 no. There we go. Yeah, but if anybody, uh, anybody ever wanted like a nice little, I don't even know. Like, I, I guess you classify that movie as a comedy. It's funny, but it's also like cool. I forgot the the two actors name that play like the kids in it, like the the young guys. Like they're so, <laughs> they're such a pa both of the characters like the movie is based around are so passive. I've never seen such a passive couple like of like to have characters where the movie is completely based off of and then them just be completely passive. Like they barely do anything in the entire movie at all. And then like you see Joe, you see Joe Pe Pesci, he does the, uh, he does the card trick in jail. You can rewind that and you can see how he does the card trick. I was thinking about like trying to do it myself and then like doing it to Danielle. Be like, check out this card trick. My cousin Vinny. Ralph Ma Macchio. Macchio, is that what it is? Ma Ralph Macchio? He, uh, they, they like nothing. <laughs> Nothing. Like, they do nothing. They do absolutely nothing. Is this good? It's definitely a Joe show. This is this is bad. This is actually bad. We have to do something solid for the ground. That's what I just did. That's different. Okay, now the, the, the ceiling is starting to be, like, too bright. That's actually awful. Speckle. Might be too bright. Might be too bright. You know what? Maybe I mix it up and I go carpet. Who knows, right? Yeah. It's a universal movie that stands the test of time. Absolutely. I agree. I agree. Like, that's a movie I could watch again. And again. Only because Joe does such a good job. Like, he's just so entertaining. And then Marissa Tomei is just like... I mean... Is Marissa to me. <laughs> kind of like that. 
Marissa Tomei when she wears that uh, like one piece, the flower one piece suit. You know that scene what I'm talking about? A good scene. I, I I don't like it. I'm I'm going carpet. I'm going carpet. I have to go carpet. This is ridiculous. Okay, we'll go carpet. We'll go carpet. Can I go black carpet? I think that's okay. I think that's better. Yeah. I, I, I think that's better. Yeah, that looks good up against the wall. Yeah, that looks really good against the wall. The ceiling's kind of throwing it off now. I might change the ceiling, possibly. Oh, the Karate Kid actor. That's who it is, the Karate Kid actor. That's what... I was like, why, why does this guy look so familiar? Duh. I was like, I've seen him before, but the name, I, you know, it's one of those names that you forget. It's like the guy, it's like the guy, like, you know their face, but you don't know their name. Like, the guy from Hot Tub Time Machine and from Sex Drive. Does anybody know what I'm talking about? Like, you know, in Hot Tub Time Machine where there's, you know, the three adults and then, like, the younger kid with the glasses. I'm talking about him. I'm talking about that actor. Nobody, like, everybody knows his name or no, everybody knows his face, but doesn't know his name. He's also in Sex Drive. He's one of the main characters in Sex Drive. Seth Green's in that movie, I believe. It's one of those characters, you know? It's one of those guys like, oh, yeah, I know who that is, but I don't know who the freaking name is. <laughs> it's an irish pub should be green carpet you know i was thinking about doing the green carpet but this green carpet looks like actually like a green screen so that's like too green <laughs> Ah, oh, The Outsiders. I haven't seen The Outsiders in so long. I know in school we read The Outsiders and then we watched it. That was probably the last time I saw that movie. Jonah Hill? No, not Jonah Hill. Jonah, you think Jonah Hill is in Hot Tub Time Machine? What the frick? No. Another one of my favorites. Stay Golden Pony Boy. Yeah, absolutely. It's a good movie. Good movie. Obviously, the book is better, but like, so good. You've never seen Hot Tub Time Machine? Do yourself a favor and like, I don't know, go on HBO Max and watch the damn movie. There's a sequel to it as well. I would say the sequel is not as good, but the first one's at least good. I think The Outsiders is on HBO Max as well. I think you watch The Outsiders on HBO. Look up the cast for Sex Drive, and you know who I'm talking about. It's the guy with the glasses. Well, I don't know if he wears. Well, I don't know if he wears glasses in his regular life, but. Right now, I'm watching your stream on my tablet and all quiet on the Western Front on Western Front on the TV. Ah, that was on Netflix. That's on Netflix. Yeah, I actually. Uh, yeah, 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 I know what you're talking about. The West, all quiet on the Western Front. I watched a quarter of that movie and then I had to stop to do something. That's all dubbed, I think, uh, dubbed in dubbed English, right? That, if I remember correctly. Pretty sure it is. I kind of want to keep the green, you know, keep the green craziness. Yeah, keep the green craziness. That's fine. Add a cash register. Sure. Ooh, where? Clark Duke. Okay, so now that's starting to sound familiar. That might be his name. He's hilarious, dude. He's funny. 
I think he's an underrated actor. He's funny, dude. Where the frick am I gonna put this? This is a terrible counter. Maybe... Maybe putting that in there was a bad idea. Maybe putting the kitchen in here probably would have been the best idea. Thinking about it now. Maybe that's what I do. Not only have I never seen it, I have never heard of it. Hey, Colin, how you doing? I haven't seen Soul Plane either. Okay, I'll be real with you. I haven't seen Soul Plane either. Like, Soul Plane seems interesting, but then, like, I'm like, I'm not interested. <laughs> Like, oh, yeah, dude, I, this, this, uh, the concept seems interesting, but, like, the casting, I'm, like, I'm not interested, really, in the casting that much. Wait a sec, does this not, can you not put this in here? Place inside? <gasps> what? That's not considered inside? You fools. Okay. Let's go right there. And let's move that over here. All right, well. That sucks. We'll go like that. Apparently this is considered outside. Interesting. That will work though. That'll do, pig. That will do. <clears throat> okay. What else do we need? The core and tables. Well, we can put tables up here and tables downstairs. What is a nice Irish pub uh, table? <clears throat> oh, that's kind of neat. I don't know how this stands as uh, as furniture, but I'm kind of interested in this. No, this goes by the bar, dude. Sick. <laughs> oh, yeah, Colin's rolling in a Tesla right now. Are you still rolling in the Tesla as we speak? Is that still rented? How's the Tesla treating you? That's not too, that's too, that looks like it hurts. I don't want to sit in that. I mean, booth seems cool, right? The booth, right? But the, the, the booth, the only thing about the booth is like, they're massive. But they do seem right. They feel good, right? That looks like an Irish pub booth. But like, I can't put it up against the window. Which is ultimately what I would want to do. Maybe I could go like this. Like, oh, that looks... Ridiculous, no? Yeah, the, I can't put these up against the wall, so I, I don't like the booths. Get the booths out of here. If I can't put them up against, against the wall, I don't want it. This seems Irish pubish, so I'm going to go pubish here. That's kind of nice. This is also kind of nice. I like that. Now we're cooking. And then downstairs, we'll add more. Yeah. I need another fryer and a grill. Let me see. Oh, frick. Another fryer and a grill. All right, well, let's make that happen, I guess. Good eye, good eye, Alexandria. Very good eye. All right, let's go grill. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, <laughs> all right. Uh, hang on a sec. Let me see how I'm going to do this. Let's go. This is going to be ridiculous. Put the refrigerator... Right here? Can I put the refrigerator here, right? No, it has to be inside. Put the refrigerator right there. That, I'm sorry for how loud that fryer is. I, I, I do apologize. Okay. Fridge goes right there. Okay. Move this over. Stove. Right there. Move this over. Sink. Right there. And then... Make it happen, I guess. There we go. Okay. And then we'll go like this. No, 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 no. Yep, 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 yep. Go like this. Stop it. You're, no. Quit it. Quit it. Quit it. This is a terrible pub. <laughs> I done F the pub. I F the pub up. Let me go like that. I'm just making it work now. 
Oh shit, dude. This is disgusting. I know, 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 I know. I'm disappointed as well. I'm disappointed as well. Just let it happen. Just let it happen. Just let it happen. Everybody, just let it happen. We're gonna let this happen. No problems here. No problems. Okay. Don't. We're okay. We're okay. We're okay. We're okay. We're okay. We're just here for the money. We're 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 here for the money. Yeah. 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 Okay. The fact. Excuse me. Excuse me. The this no. Look here. Look here. This 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 works. You can't tell me that doesn't work. You. You go over there. How about that? Okay. Then you. Stay here. There we go. We've done it. We did it. We did it. We just did it. We did it. Hooray! Get me the hell out of here. All right. That it's a disaster back there. I don't want to. Yeah. I don't want to. Yeah. I don't want to deal with that. All right, let's go downstairs a little bit now. Furniture. Furniture. Keep it coming. I kind of like this, so keep it coming. This is definitely where people are, like, gambling. You need special access to get down here, 100%. Can I put that right there? Ooh. There we are. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want to buy a Tesla now? Hey! Love your gameplays. Also try card telling Sim. Smiley face. Hey! MK Vlogs, how's it going? Appreciate that. Thank you for the super chat. Also try card detailing Sim. We actually have that on the channel, yeah? Do you ever want to check it out? Just search in the channel and you will find card detailing Sim. All right, what else do we need? Decor and entertainment. This is where, yeah, this is where you definitely would see a pool table. Now, you have to give them respect on their elbow game. Like, if they come over... This is the weirdest looking pool table. This is all length and not girth. Okay. Am I starting a new coffee shop? Uh, no. Wait, no. No, this... What I'm doing right now is just a... Um, this is just a mission. There we go. Arcade. That's another one. And then hit me with a something else. Not a ping pong table. We're not doing ping pong table. Hit me with a jukebox that I will not listen to. This is for decor. Okay, don't turn it on. Just leave it there. Okay, that's fine. Uh, one out of two tables. What? Excuse me, what? One out of two tables? Five tables? Oh, kitchen. Kitchen me. Oh, F me sideways. <sighs> I'm putting a smaller kitchen. I have to put a kitchen in here? Can I put this back here? No? Oh, frickin'. Frickin' dink. Okay, look. This is... This is what we do. We put the refrigerator back here. <laughs> oh, this... Is, now, okay, to be fair, I think in the game... Probably with, like, the updated uh, patch and all that. You probably wouldn't have this much trouble that, like, I'm having. This probably would have been fixed. Because I'm assuming, like, this is wrong. That you, you should be able to place stuff in there. But well, it's alright. Get our kitchen table in there. There we go. Perfect. Okay. Alright. Anybody want to grab, you know, something out of the fridge? You're more than welcome to. Absolutely. Do I need another sink, too? I do. I do. I need another sink as well. Okay, this is this is easier. I can get I can get away with this, right? <laughs> oh my god. Um can I put the sink back here? Yes, put the sink back here at the bar. Sick, dude. And then I need a ventilation as well. Give me another ventilation. Put the ventilation like right there. Okay, hey. I think we've kind of figured it out. And now let's go with a, a decor item. Something, uh, something, something. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Perfect. All right. Now, bathroom. I'm assuming this is where the bathroom goes, for sure. Woo! <clears throat> hey, Makiki, how you doing? And my tables didn't count? Uh, excuse me, what? Uh, I think they did. I think you might be confused at the kitchen table. Uh, let's see. Let's go with toilets. And let's put in a ridiculous looking stall. It says zero out of four. Wash closet, right? Wash. Wash closet, depending on where you live. Wash. Let me wash my hands. Right? Now, all it says is WC. It doesn't say anything in particular. I guess I could put anything in here. It does. Double fisted hand dryer. You don't see those quite often, do you? Oh, wait a sec. That didn't count? Oh, F me. That little uh, hand dryer didn't count. Does the soap count at least? No, it doesn't. Okay, right. <laughs> oh, go figure. All right, well, uh, give me like another sink, I guess. Give me another sink with no, uh, no mirror. And that will be that. We can't repair this little piece here that's our 1% that we're missing. I just can't get to it. So that's fine. There's the pub. There's the pub. Let's go back home. $6,500 with a new logo, new furniture, and all the above. Hooray! <laughs> That's just how Irish pool tables are. They're long. <laughs> They're long and no girth. <laughs> okay. Uh. Is it safe to have those fryers on the carpet? It's not safe for any of that kitchen to be anywhere where it was at. <laughs> that kitchen was not up to code, I tell you. Hey, Chris, how you doing, Chris? Good to see you. I hope you're doing well. Meals in the oven already. Meals in the oven already. Move to the shelf. I could I could bake some more. I, yeah, let's do it. Let's not, not do it. Eclairs, put them in. I should have did croissants. F. Can I redo that? Redo? No? F. All right, all right, all right. E clear as it is. Should have put the croissants. Now I can uh, expand out. Yeah, I can definitely expand out now. So that's that's good, right? I'm gonna be like cans when I grow up. Trust me, you have better options out there. <laughs> you got better options. Let's go. Uh, my restaurant into a nine thousand dollar expansion. Please and thank you. Take a look. Hey, look at that. Oh, very cool. Hooray. Whoops. Call the garbage truck. Um, bu 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 garbage removal. Thank you. We're still looking for Bigfoot. We're still looking for Bigfoot. But now we have this opened up. And then the next thing, the last thing will be the, um, the outside terrace. Oh, very good. Uh, crap. Let's not get ourselves stuck here. Hooray. Trash can is now empty. So you pay a lot of money for an expansion and then they still make you work for it? Oh, yeah. You pay a lot of money for expansion and then, like... <laughs> like, I don't know who's the one, like, over here delegating, like, oh, yeah, you know what? You, you, can, you can have a little tiny slice of this building. And then when you give me more money, you can have another ti tiny slice of this building where you have to clean it yourself and make repairs for yourself. Like, okay. Oh, hey, he's actually cleaning. Good for him. Something just broke downstairs. I'll help you with that there, buddy. I think we will turn this into a different theme, possibly. Yeah, we'll turn it into a different thing. We'll keep it, like, different colors and all that fun stuff, right? Lady Casca. How you doing, Lady Casca? Hope you're doing well. 
It's good to see you. How you doing? Going to zoom that. Send it. Okay. Minted green chocolate chip on the docket today. Nope. We will keep, I think we'll keep the same ceiling, but we'll just change the wallpaper going into here. Now, wait a sec. This. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. Yep. See me as I put my seatbelt on. Um, <clears throat> this will probably be entertainment. Like pool table, ping pong tables, you know, all of the above. Right. Beer pong. Every frat ever existed says they invented beer pong. We'll never know where it originated from. Okay. But we will look at our skills. <clears throat> um, increase the speed of equipment. No, increase the speed of your staff. Kind of like that. Uh, your staff will be able to suggest customers buy an additional dish. Kind of like that. Increases the amount of reputation the restaurant receives. Really like that. I go restorator. Excuse me, restorator. Thank you. Okay, cool. And then we figure out what we want. Um, well, we want to keep it same carpet, maybe same uh, ceiling, different wallpaper. That's what we're going to do. I think we went carpet, right? Right? We went black carpet in here too. Like this carpet. Like a brown. Okay, that is freaking frack. That is not it, but I feel like I need to replace that carpet in there. Wait, is that the same carpet? Just not light. Yeah, it is the same carpet. I know they're different colors, but I think it's because it's the lighting that's throwing it off. Yeah, it's the lighting that's throwing it off. Interesting. What about a romantic lounge outside? Now you're speaking my language. How you doing, Nicole? How you doing? Hey, Lalu, how's it going? Hey, Alexander, how you doing? <clears throat> Wonder if you will ever try Dragon Quest Builders? Uh, I have tried Dragon Quest Builders too on the channel. Yeah. I wonder if Kans will ever play Dinkum. Come on. You know better. You know better. <laughs> Garbage removal. Okay. So, um, yeah. Entertainment, some pool tables, some something. Uh, we need the same ceiling though. No. There we go. Hey Maggie, how you doing? Hey Glitter Glam, how you doing? I forgot which one it was. This one? Is that the same one? Okay, it is the same one. The only thing that throws it off is the lighting. Okay, so once we put lighting in here, we'll definitely do it. Hey, Mos I, I, oh, I keep wanting to say Mos Eisley, but it's Moss Eisley. How you doing, Moss Eisley? Lurking on the Xbox again? Oh, very good. Mm -hmm. There we go. There we go. What the hell was that? I don't know what kind of color I'm going to go for. What kind of wallpaper I'm going to go for for a entertainment lounge area. Who knows? Furniture. I definitely want a pool table. That's, that's, that's that. It might not open. Sorry, we're closed. Ready to open? Yeah, dude. Open. No, actually closed because I can't buy anything. I can't do any improvements if I don't have, if I'm not closed. Right. Uh, let's see. Wallpaper. What should I go with? I do like, I, I am a floral kind of guy. Right. I am a floral kind of guy. I do like me with some floral. I am, I am, I am. But also, like, this is fancy. That is damn bright. What the hell is that? Somebody turned the light off? Uh, right. You know what? Before we put any wallpaper down, one thing that we have to do is probably put lighting in so that we understand what we're getting ourselves into. What kind of lighting would you have in here into the fancy entertainment uh, area? Nothing that has dangling balls, okay? We don't want dangling bulbs or bulbs. Because if you're rolling with a pool stick, you know what you're going to do. You're going to whack the freaking bulbs uh, on the ceiling. So it has to be something that's uh, stationary, not dangling. 
God damn the colors. And <laughs> it went from black to like, it's like reflection. There's like some weird color going on here. I don't know. Okay. Now we'll go to wallpaper. Actually, walls. Walls? Walls. What does this look like? That is actually terrible. That's something straight out of it, like Atlantis or something. Not that Atlantis is a bad movie. Atlantis is a good movie. This is more like... This is more fancy dancy, you know? That is fancy dancy. In a way. Kind of. P.S. I got into Dragon Quest Builders 2 after I was watching a Dinkum VOD and you... Chat, we're talking about it. Almost done with the main story and ready to build amazing things. Oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. I hope you're enjoying that. I do. I do. Hope you're enjoying that game. I like this too. That's more kind of... Well, that doesn't really go with anything. Hate that. This. Double hate that. Uh, This. Ooh, it kind of it kind of transitions a bit into like blue into this kind of like cream color maybe I don't know. I think we need more lighting in here honestly. Okay, you know what? Get this out of here. We need more and better lighting. Give me the big guy. Yep. Give me the big guy. That's what I'm talking about. Thank you. Now look at the. <laughs> now we're glowing. Yep, now we're glowing. Okay, all right. I feel you. Let's see, let's see. Ooh. Ooh, kind of like mint going into like a green. It would look better if it wasn't so damn bright in here, huh? Ooh, I really like this color. And I might make sacrifices for this just because I like it. A lot. And you know what? He is going to make a sacrifice. Remember what I said about the dangling bulbs, balls, things? Disregard that. Disregard that. Well, this isn't very too dangly. This is what we're doing. Yes! This? No. Yes? This? Need to go. There we go. There we go. L little l uh, transition. This gotta go. No, not the freaking claw. This gotta go. Trying to make it more uh, intimate, so to speak, or intimate, more intimate. Yes, more intimate. Kind of. Hopefully. Exterior. No. I need I need games. Give me no. I need special. Thank you. I need I need this. I need that to go right there. That actually could be moved though. I could put this in the entertainment um kind of room dealio thing. Possibly. I might move this now thinking about it. But there we go. Okay, now let oh. Oh, I don't know. Having the wallpaper all one same would actually look really good, too. I really like this wallpaper. I do. I'm a big fan of this. I've been thinking... I've been thinking around with King Arito after watching the vids. The VODs? Vids? Videos. Either one. Um, <clears throat> yeah, King Arito's a fun game, for sure. There's a lot to do in it. For sure, for sure. I think it's a it's it's a fun game. One hundred percent. I feel like if I just went all around, just like if the lighting on that just looks crazy. Where is that light coming from? That's what I want to know. I want to know where that light is coming from to make it so wild. I don't know where it's coming from. I'll fix it. It'll just be a, it won't be a simple transition, but it will be a transition. That's what we'll do. A transition. Yep. The all weighted uh, pool table, please. 
the long four pool table. Put the pool table down. Do not throw your elbow into here. I actually have. I've talked. <laughs> I've talked about this before, I, in multiple streams in the past, like few months and things like this, where I'm like, I really like end goal life. Look it, end goal life. I want to have a pool table in that in in. In a, in a living situation, I want to have a pool table. Many times, people are like, pool tables are overrated. Pool tables are heavy. Pool tables, this and that and that and this. But as a social event, I would always want a pool table. Now, forgettably, I have totally forgot and disregarded that there is a pool table literally like 50 feet behind me. <laughs> May okay. Maybe 75 to 100 feet that way behind me is an actual pool table. I always forget about it. It's a community uh, community center that we have here where I live. Where there's like a pool. There's a kitchen. There's a pool table. There's an actual swimming pool, you know. There's laundromats. This is not the same though, okay? I want to have my own. I don't want anybody to touch it. <laughs> I don't want anybody to touch it at free will. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Yo, we can have some spicy dark times in here. Yeah. Gotta have the black light, right? It looks terrible, but I'm doing it. I'm not putting something on this wall because I know this wall is going to disappear, right? Cessna coming in. <laughs> that looks cool. It does. It looks cool. I guess. I don't know. It's something special. It's something new. What the hell is the rest of this stuff? Like this? Like I would buy this, but I wouldn't use it. Copyright? $1,500 is all that we have. Anything else that I could do? Like a nice, um, not a cat. I guess I could do something. Right? What the heck is this? This is an A air. Duck, air unit, air unit. There's cockroaches, F. Gotta put the air unit. Actually, you know what? Let's move that. Maybe we put that like, well, I don't know. Let, yeah, right there. That's fine. Like right here. That's good. That's good. There we go. Mm-mm-mm-mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Have a good one. Oh, God. Was it Bobby, right? Bobby, yeah? Bobby? Bobby. If you ever get a chance, change your wife's name so I, I know how to address you, so that I can remember how to address you, because I would hate to call you Crystal again. <laughs> if that's not your name. But I hope you do take care. Thanks for stopping in and saying hello to us and hanging out with us. Absolutely. Um... I will put a TV in. Oh, frick, dude. That's a massive TV. That's a big boy TV. That might be too big. Put like a... Uh, uh, <laughs> put like a TV right here. You know what? Get rid of that, though. I'm just playing. He can buzz off. Oh, okay. Well, in that case, buzz off. <laughs> Home Alone 2, buzz. There we go. I okay, but I could put the massive. Okay, massive TV might be too much. Okay, might be too much. Use that for the romantic lounge. Should the romantic lounge be outside then? Is that is that is that what we've come to our uh, senses here? Is like just outside. And if anybody wants to get nice and uh, cheeky, they can just go outside, like a couple of dogs, and just go outside. You want to have that romantic stuff here? No, go outside. Something just broke. I really hope I can slide this right in there. Oh, frick. I want this to line up with the TV. Frick. Try again. You hear that? Oh God! It's worse. It's hard to line it up. It is. It's. 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 It's a little difficult. A little difficult. Oh, yeah. At 
I don't think it's going to work. <laughs> I think what I do is I place this. And then I line the TV up with it. How about that? So maybe I try to line this up with the pool table. Try to. Keyword. Place it down, good man. Place it down. You know what? Good enough. And then I line it up with the TV. And then maybe what I do is I line the pool table up with all that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Just don't hit the balls on that side because you're going to get blocked. You're going to get... Well, I guess you, you have enough room to hit it, maybe. Yeah. Okay, that thing is driving me nuts downstairs. Let me go take care of that. What the frick happened? Oh, God. Stop it. Stop it. Enough. Enough. That had an over the table. Snooked table. Put it over the dining table to use it. Sounds like a functionally fun product. It worked, stored it in the garage through the door in the dining room hall. Hey, Ashad, how you doing, Ashad? Okay, all right. Oh, God, the freaking, hang on. Let me take care of this guy. First thing, pet the cat. Second thing, take care of this guy. Third thing, I haven't seen the, the Bigfoot yet. Yeah, 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 yeah. Get out of here. A snooker. Snook? Uh, what's the guy's name from Star Wars? Snope? Is that what it is? Snope? Snooker, Snope, Snope. <gasps> Oops. It's Snope, isn't it? I think it's Snope. Yeah, I think it's Snope. There we go. And then let's see. We have to add a little bit more something in here, yeah? Gotta put some sort of... Yeah! Oh, it's massive, dude. Okay, we'll put that right here instead. No, well, the lighting there is bad. This doesn't make sense on a window. I hate that. I kind of like it over here. It's like winter vibes. You know what? I'll put that over here, even though the lighting's bad. Man, that does no justice there, does it? So dark. Hey, Lean. How you doing, Lean? And then in here, you got to put like... What was the like... Uh, there was like another neon light type thing. Where was it? It was like, um, not selling. Kitchen? No. Special? No. Furniture. It was furniture. Oh, the dragon. Oh, wait. We have eight. I forgot. <laughs> I forgot that we're not playing with, like, free money here. We're actually playing with a lot of money. Uh, with our own money. But I would like to put, like, a bar neon light here, even though this isn't a bar. But who's going to tell me it's not? Right? That's kind of cool. I guess that's good for now. Wait, is there rugs in this game? Can we put, like, awesome rugs? I mean, there's this, but... That's pretty much it. Exterior? That's what we're gonna have to do outside. Okay, that's good. I guess we can open. Open business, baby! Let's go! Bring it in! We need to sell 15 pizzas! 15! pizzas now if I wanted to make this go faster I guess I could like take everything off except for pizzas what if I do that let's do that shall we let's do that let's go uh, hang on let's close again let's go to menu take lasagna off this 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 and this increase the price a bit uh, nine Okay, six. Okay, we'll do that. We'll just sell pizza, straight up pizza for right now. Go to our food store. Buy anything that we need. Apparently that. No, maybe not. F. That's good. That's... Mm, don't know why I just bought that. Uh, This is good. We need that. Okay. That wouldn't hurt. That wouldn't hurt. Okay, that wouldn't hurt. We're good. 
Okay, how much money we got? 652. Okay, now let's open. And let's go deliver our... Oh, no, not the rats. Come on, cat. You got to catch that. Come on, cat. You got to catch that. Okay, now we're good. Put a hookah in. I have a hookah in the in the actual... I have it next to the couch. I guess I could put another hookah in there, right? We got two hookahs going on. Hey, Gordon. How you doing, Gordon? Good evening for... Our, I don't know why I took this box this way. Good evening for out the far for out the Netherlands. And hi all. Hello, Hoppy. How you doing? How's it going, Hoppy? Hope you're having a good evening on this Saturday evening. How you doing, crazy one? Hope you're having a good crazy evening or afternoon or Saturday. You have paid the employees $330. That hurt. Oh, from. <laughs> from out the Netherlands. From out the Netherlands. Gotta love it. <clears throat> How's my day going? My day's just starting. My day is just starting and is the uh, we're still in the a.m. over here on our, tw you know, 12 hour format. We're still in the a.m. Still trying to whisk off a little bit of that morning rust. Other than that, doing good on a Saturday. Um, you know, waiting patiently for Danielle to get home in a couple of days. No, tomorrow. Tomorrow night she'll be home. Frick. She's right now in Salem. Shout out to Salem. Okay, so. Now what we need to do is sell 15 pizzas to customers. Now I'm going to keep my eye on this. I'm going to see how this goes. and see if our, if our tally is going to be whacked here. Our tally whacker is going to be whacked. Or their tally is going to... If it's going to, you know, count, I guess is the way I'm, I, what, what I'm trying to say here. <laughs> Six hour difference. It's almost 2100. Uh, what's 2100? 2100 is, what is that? Uh, 2100 is like 9 p.m., right? If you're at 9 p.m., then we're about nine hours apart yeah we're nine hours apart not six hours nine hours difference it's about 11 42 right now in the morning you're like whoa did i just realize that you're that far apart from me oh my lord did our time zones really are our time zones really that far apart i know i don't live on the east coast if i lived on the east coast we'd be six hours apart but i don't I'm West Side, West Side Story. <clears throat> so did that count? Yeah, so we got one pizza done. One not pizza done. Oh, one pizza done. Gotta sell 15 pizzas. This still seems empty, but I'll... I'll, I don't want to put anything up against this wall because, like I said, it's going to, like, I don't know how big of the, I don't know if this entire wall will go or what the deal is, but I know something will go there. Or, like, it will be pushed out. I guess I could check. It might be, like, this little tiny section here that gets cut out. Uh -huh. Two pizzas have been sold. Thank you for the tip. And now the next thing that I'm waiting for is simply just... Uh... Well, I mean, maybe, I don't know if there's another job. I think that might have been our last job, the Irish pub. But I'm also waiting for uh, whenever, I mean, it was raining nonstop last time we played. And now we can't, like, <laughs> now we can't even, like, get a, uh, get a thing going on here. Can't, can't get a, a storm so that we can take out the, uh, I say take out the Bigfoot, but you know what I'm talking about. Let's change our wallpaper. Let's spice it up, shall we? I would like to go management and pay everybody a premium.
Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. We're almost level 10, by the way, too. What are you doing? Order up, mother effer. Excuse me, are you, like, trying to deliver something up here? What are you trying to do? Okay, he delivered it. Okay, all right. The tables upstairs kind of, like, they hurt me. They do hurt me. They do. It's always fun to see people from all around the world here. I know, right? It's pretty awesome. It's like its own. It's like it's its, it's own Epcot or something. We got it's like our own Epcot role in here. I always go wrong with P the PM and AM. Do you guys have like a little reminder for me to keep them apart? Um, minus twelve. But if you mean, like, to keep them apart from p.m. and a.m., like, in real life, uh, we usually have, like, a.m. or p.m. after the, after the numbers. But if you're trying to go from, like, you know, say, like, 2100, what is that in, you know, just be like, boom, minus 12. If you are at 1200 hours, so to speak... Anything past 1,200 hours is p.m. Anything before 1,200 hours is a.m. Maybe that's a little bit easier to remember, too. I shall not get a uh, penalty. No, thank you. P is earlier than A. No, P is after A. A is the morning time. So think of A as the first letter. Right? A becomes A comes before P. So that's the first 12 hours. And then the P is the, you know, the last 12 hours. So if you're like, oh, you know, the first 12 hours of the day is the a train <laughs> the a m because a comes before p <laughs> all right i'm gonna wait till we get this 15 sold freaking pizzas so i guess after pizzas then we have to sell all burgers yeah I could get another ca I get a kitchen staff, right? Or another kitchen counter? No. I mean, I could. Would it be worth it? No. Maybe. Maybe it would be worth it. Yeah, it might be worth it. I'm thinking of an idea here. Let's see. Let's go. Um, can I sell this? You can't sell it until the uh, store is closed. Let's sell. First, close the store. Okay, I have to close the store if I want to do that. F. Okay. I'm going to. Th I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to put another kitchen counter right here and then hire another employee to run it. I think we're going to have two. If we can, I guess. I don't know. Can we? I don't, maybe we can or not. I don't know. <laughs> Who knows? Don't ask me tomorrow because I'll probably forget after pizza comes beer, right? Yeah, well, yeah, it's rightfully so. Well, in some cases, probably beer comes before pizza. <laughs> Depends on how you roll, I guess, right? Shame you can't hire wait staff separate from the counter. I know, right? But can I hire a hostess? Can I hire a hostess that, you know, takes their job way too seriously because they have an earpiece in their ear and they're like, like orchestrating a freaking, uh, circus. They're like orchest orchestrating like circus delay, you know, circus delay. Like how many is that table for how much? Oh, oh, okay. Yeah. Table, ta table for four. Janet, excuse me. Jan do we, ta we got four. No, uh, 20 minutes. How many, six people for you? Yeah. All right. Janet, do we six people? Six, yeah, six people. Come this way. Come this way. Calm down. You work at Red Robin. Okay? It's all right. 
I understand it can be stressful, but all you have to do is put my ass in a table. That's all you got to do, okay? I don't care who the hell my waiter is. I don't care who my waitress is. I know there's like... Honestly, don't even throw me the fairness game, okay? Like, oh, we have to have fairness because these people need to have uh, customers and these people need to have the right amount of... Don't tell me that because at the end of the day, all y'all are putting your tips in the same pile and splitting it. So where's the fairness in that? Okay, where's the fairness in that? I hate... I hate when, when companies do that. When they make you put all your tips in the same pile. And then split it. That's a bunch of BS. That's how you that's how you not get good service. That's how you get waiters and waitresses that don't give a damn anymore. They're like, yeah, why why should I put in the effort? Somebody else will do it for me. And then I'll get like more money without having to put in effort. Right? Get that out of here. Every waiter... Every waitress, every bartender, anybody. They should be able to make their tips based off of their ability to be, to do the job and to put on a fantastic show. <laughs> I say fantastic show, but you know, to put, to do their job and give great service. Absolutely. That, 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 they should be awarded with that. Because if you have a, a waiter, a waitress, a bartender, you know, serving the customer and they're working for their own tips, like, you're going to get the best out of them. You are. And they're going to make your establishment look great. 100%. 100%. How you doing, Brass Butterfly? How's it going? How's it going? <laughs> That's why I work alone on on Sundays, open to close. <laughs> Not all places tip share. I think the most the majority of places that tip share are like um are the places that are like like big like what what do you call them? Like Big chain restaurants, I guess that's what you say, right? Big chain restaurants. You hate the idea of the tip system? That's interesting. That's interesting. I think if you hate the idea of the, like, unless, unless you have been in a, unless you've done a job where you had to serve people and then you hate the tip system, I wonder, I wonder... I just wonder. <laughs> I wonder. Hey, ten thousand dollars there. Yeah, waitresses live on tips, right? Uh, because they don't have a high hourly rate. You basically get paid minimum wage, and then bartenders and waitresses live on tips. However, however, depending on where you work, and you don't split tips and all that, right? Depending on where you work, you make a ton of money on the tips, right? People, I see it all the time. I see people in their 30s. I see people in their 40s. They go get a degree in college. And you know what they do with that degree? They don't do jack-ish with the degree. You know why? Because they make so much money through tips and through off of their ability to help and serve people. That's bas basically it. This is countless of people I know stay in the, in the what, what is it called? The hospitality? Is that what it says? Hospitality? Um... So it is hospitality, I guess you could say. Uh, area of freaking, you know, of job, sorry, of the job. Uh, and, and the tips, like, the tips do well. Yeah. They would, uh, they would rather do that than what they went to school for. <coughs> I work in a coffee shop and we don't often get tips but fair wages. Well, coffee, coffee shops... Like, if you talk about, like, coffee shops, like, Starbucks, I'm not saying you work at Starbucks or anything, but, like, kind of things like that, you don't really see, like, a lot of people tipping, um, because you just walk up to the counter, hey, can I get a coffee, they make a coffee, boom, bam. But if people are, like, going and they're serving you and they're, like, bringing food to you, they're taking down what you need or what you want, 
in an order when you're in a comfy chair or a comfy booth. Uh, they're basically all to your needs at one time, right? They're like, hey, is there anything I can do for you? Let me know and I'll take care of it type thing. Basically a service person, right? <laughs> Serving you. Sir, I don't want to say a servant or a butler, but you, you understand, right? That's, you know, and then like people that drive you places like, you know, a taxi cab, uh, maybe a limo, <laughs> maybe an Uber. You tip someone because you, uh, you, you know, they drove you somewhere. Basically, you know, you tip the freaking bellhop because they picked up your heavy ass luggages that weighed way more than 50 pounds than what was supposed to be on the Southwest airline because Southwest specifically told you not to go 50 pounds and over on your luggage, but you did anyways because you had to get that hair dryer in there. And so your bellhop has to carry the the uh the suitcases up the stairs because the elevator broke last night for some odd reason you know so you just hand them a five dollar says thank you for the service thank you for bringing up my bags to my room type thing you know different things of course right a lot of different things i have ten thousand dollars but i don't have enough to actually buy what i want here <laughs> so i'm gonna wait till we sell f more food we I, I think we need more of this yeah we need a little bit more of this ham and we need a little bit more of this ketchup. Please and thank you. Do you tip in fast food restaurants? Yes, you absolutely do tip fast food restaurants. No, wait, fast food. Sorry, no, not fast food. Regular restaurants. Actually, take that back. There are fast food restaurants that do say tip. Yep. Yep, I take that back. There is quick service restaurants that uh, say tip. Will you tip? Um, like, I've gone to a, uh, I don't even know what it's called. Uh, like, anybody know what Poke Bowls are? I've gone to a place where you go for, like, a Poke Bowl. And, like, you go up to a counter like this, kind of like a like a Subway thing. And you're, like, go down the line. Like, okay, I want this on my, this, 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 this. And then at the end of it, they're like, would you tip? Now, you can pick and choose your tips, of course. I've had a place where you go up to the counter, right? You walk up to the counter, and you're like, yes, I would like some fried chicken. And they said, okay, great. That will be, uh, you know, fifteen forty nine. And I say, fantastic. Thank you for the fried chicken. All the person had to do behind the counter was type it into the little iPad. And then they say, you know, on the iPad, they, they, they scan your card, and then they show you the iPad, and the iPad says, would you like to tip? You know? So there are fast food restaurants that do say, uh, will, would you tip? So yes, there are those. But those people are not serving you personally. They're not uh, going out of their way, right? They're, they're not. I worked at Denny's and I quit. We got paid four ninety five and wait, you got paid four hundred ninety five dollars an hour plus tips, and a majority of the patrons wouldn't tip very well. They would order $50, $60 worth of food and only took me $5. Tip you $5. Okay, well, there th that's the problem is because it all depends on where you go and where you work at. People that are going to Denny's, like, it's the cheaper of the restaurants. They probably don't have a lot of money. I know there's people out there that don't have, like, tip etiquette. I always tip. I always, you know, that's just the person I am. I just tip for someone serving me. That I, I guess it kind of comes down, right? There are people that won't tip. There's people that will tip very low type thing. I guess it just all depends. Like, the standard here, where I live, is you tip at least 15%. At least 15%. You know? But, you know, it could be different where you live. I called in the garbage truck guy. I might need to get more sodas, too. I know, we still need a picture of Bigfoot. It's raining, at least. That's that's something. Now we just need him to come out. I earned a bra. And a 7-up. You have Poke Bowls here? Okay, so then at like a Poke Bowl restaurant, they ask for tips. At least where I live, they do. You go to sushi, do you tip? Yeah. One time at Denny's, I had a group of teenagers come in there. Bill was $80 and left the quarter. Now that is just obviously just immature, <laughs> immaturity, but 
I don't, I don't, I don't, you know, there isn't a, there's, there's also things called like, uh, gratuity fees. There's gratu gratuity fees. By the way, we got the, uh, pizzas. Now we can move on to, uh, burgers. If you have a party, like, over six people or over five people, they'll charge you X amount of dollars. They'll say, okay, if your party is, like, six people or more, we will add an additional, like, $40 to your bill as a gratuity, gratu gratuity fee. That's what it's called, a gratuity. So there's also restaurants that do that, too. It just depends. It just depends on where you live and where where you're working at. Like, like I said, if you work at Denny's, most of the time the people there are really going out to eat because they are, and I'm 100% I'm that person. I'm the person that goes out to Denny's with Danielle because one, we like Denny's, and two, it's one of the cheaper restaurants, right? Balling on a budget, you know what I mean? So, not everybody can go to like a ridiculous like Olive Garden, you know? Look at me strike up a conversation now. This is, this is, this is the stream. This is how you stream, right? Absolutely. This is how you stream. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I have a mission. Hey, Zach Toll, thank you for the membership. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. I think I could do it. I think I could do it. I had to close down anyways and bring... Wait, sorry. Restaurant's open. No, no. Restaurant's closed. I got to bring burgers back, but we can at least do this. Sometimes if the service is excellent, I try to tip as close to the amount of the bill. That's incredible. If you try to tip to the amount of the bill, that is incredible. That's like an awesome tip. Hey! I will tip my streamer. Smiley <laughs> face. Smiley face. Hey, thank you very much, Lean. I appreciate that. Then, yeah, you know. There's also the tipping your your content creators or streamers to help them, you know, stay in business. I appreciate that. Thank you, Lean. That was very kind of you. I appreciate that. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. That was very kind of you. <laughs> appreciate that. Cafe on the Beach. The Bears family had a lifelong dream of opening their own oceanfront cafe. Now, their dream is a reality. They took out a loan from Gold Bank and took a long time to choose the person for the job. One day, they drove by your restaurant in Castle Lake and couldn't get past it. They really liked your interior and the way you set everything up in the end. Oh, in the end, they decided to give it to you. Our bureau thinks no one can do the job better than you. Okay, $8,000, new logo, and XP. Yeah, I appreciate that. And that kind of goes on with the lean is like content creators, streamers, and things like that. They basically, they live off of the generosity of people. And that's basically what it comes down to is the generosity of people, tips and stuff like that. Some waiters and waitresses, they only get paid minimum wage. And so they will live off of the generosity of people as well. It's one of the hardest things to do. And a very, very anxiety, anxiety filled, anxious feeling. But um, it's a very rewarding feeling too to be able to serve people also. So there's, you know, balancing in it. In it. We plan to own, open a typical seaside cafe here with a nice interior. We've already done the walls. Choose a covering for the ceiling and the floor. Take out the trash, yeah, all the good stuff. We definitely will do that. Holy crap, this looks awesome. This is like the main menu, dude. Yeah. My sister's husband has a security company. I helped out when I could. So when I had to drive them in Belgium, we went out every evening. They always tip like 20% of the bill. Yeah. Yeah, that... that that seems, um, and that, that, you know, I mean, yeah, 20, 15 to 20%, right? And I know some people, like, some people can't afford that, right? <laughs> it, it, I don't know, 15, 20% of the bill, it just, it, it just depends, right? It depends. Last time I went to Subway, the guy asked me not to tip through the credit card machine because the employees never received those tips. So I guess cash tips are still always best case. Oh yeah, cash tips are always best case. Uh, if you tip, I mean, there, I mean, if you go to a restaurant, I don't know about Subway, but if you go to like a restaurant, you know, leaving a tip through card is fine. What I do typically is I usually, um, 
I usually tip through uh, like cash because cash is now you get cash now they get the cash now um, some places you know they get the cash maybe at the end of the month or what, whatever it might be right so I it, when I go I, I try to uh, tip cash just so that the waiter gets it and I know that they get it and if they have to put it into a pot to split hopefully that waiter takes my tip and says you know what I'm not gonna put my money in the pot and just you know hopefully they hold on to it for themselves type thing The only Pokeball, Pokeball I know has a Pokemon in them. <laughs> when I was serving, I always rationed that the bad and good tips evened out so I wouldn't fret over the people who left cents or nothing. It made me feel a little better. Oh, that, well, you know what? If you could find, the, like, yeah, like you said, if you find that happy medium, right? And they'll be, you know, they're, they're, one thing about life is, like, You'll find a mass amount of generosity where you least expect it. And it will come by you to surprise. And there are generous, very, very generous people out there. Absolutely. You know, we all are in different stages of our lives, you know? So, there's, there's, there's not everybody is, you know. <laughs> if you have a bad experience with anybody with anything in life, it's not always the case, you know? One tainted apple can't spoil the tree, you know? Just like in anything, really. I currently oh, I currently earn 35 an hour. If I open my business, I can earn 60 an hour. And if I also do a cert four in my field, I could charge up to $90 an hour. Now, what kind of business is that? Usually when you open up a business, you typically pay yourself less, but it probably is, if I'm assuming it's maybe something you do with, that's not physical products, and maybe it's like a, uh, like some sort of service through electronically, question mark. Subway is a franchise, so only the owner of that location would get the tip if added to a credit card. Worked that way when I worked that one. Yeah, and I think that's that's exactly it. It's like it all depends on like where you where you work. For instance, if you did tip at at Subway, you could definitely get like a franchise owner that's like, oh yeah, you earn this amount of money in tips. That's the scummy thing. Is I don't think if it, if you if you're an owner that owns like the franchise of a freaking Subway. You should not be receiving, even if you own a restaurant. If you own a restaurant, it doesn't even have to be a Subway. If you own any restaurant, your ass better not be taking money or a percentage of money from your waiters and waitresses from their tips. That is one of the worst things you could possibly do. It's just terrible. You, you don't do that. That's, that's not what an owner does. No. Nope. Absolutely not. Have I managed to get the photo? No, I'm still working on the Bigfoot photo. It hasn't stormed yet, really. It just started raining after we left, but uh, it hasn't really stormed yet. Dude, this place is dark. Oh, disability support. Okay, so that yeah, that's a uh, that's a whole nother field. There we go. Do you make products for like disability for support or do you offer services type thing? That's actually illegal at least where I live. So you're saying the owners taking the tips is illegal? That's good. I hope it, I hope that is the case cuz that's that's a no-no. That's a no-no. We got tips when when handed to us personally. Once got a Sublime CD for one. <laughs> Sublime CD for one. That's awesome. 
that's funny. That's funny. I used to work, like, look, I used to, most of y'all know, I used to work at retail. I got tips in retail, too. Like, even just retail, people were just like, hey, man, like, your service was awesome. Can I, like, give you a tip? And depending on where I lived at that time, not where I lived, where I worked at that time, I was like, you know, that is so awesome, but, like, I'm not allowed to accept a tip because I work at Radio Shack because we get commission and an hourly rate. And they're like, oh, well, you know. And my boss was like, just don't, just, just, just accept it. Just take it. Don't tell anybody. You know, it's like, all right, well, sure. But like even people in retail, there's people in retail that sometimes get tips. Like, could you imagine an hourly rate, a commission rate, and a freaking tip? <laughs> That's how Radio Shack went out of business. No. <laughs> not how it is they made a lot more a lot more mistakes uh prior to that they had a lot of managers that were grandfathered into these massive salaries let's just say that whoops there we go there we go Pop that that's good oh no. that's good go on the roof I think I went up that wrong. That's all right. Figured it out anyways. Uh... Well, it only took two hours, but all my Christmas gift stuff is wrapped. I'm done with Christmas responsibilities. Thanks for keeping me entertained during the insanity. Oh, no problem. No problem. Hey, I think some of us are a little jealous over that. Glad you got it all done. I can't believe, what is this, like, I guess we're, what, almost two weeks away? Crazy. Crazy noise. Two weeks away, right? Two weeks away, just about, from Christmas. Crazy. Did I miss, did I miss one of the, one of the rails down there? Hang on, we should actually take up the uh, task. Repair, cleaning, okay, yeah, there's a lot of cl uh, repairing I need to do. Still gotta do this though. Hey, look at that. There's a can right there too. There's a can can. Anybody know about the can can? Looking after people with disabilities. In Australia, we don't have uh, typical group homes anymore. They live in normal homes and have support for daily life and community access. Okay, I see. I see. Oh, we, we got the repair. I guess we just need to get a little bit of cleaning. What's the last cleaning? Where's the last bit of cleaning? Um, I don't know. Maybe outside? I'm very jealous. <laughs> Have a good night, Lean. Do take care. Do take care. Thanks for hanging out with us. We appreciate it. And I uh, hope you have a good rest of your night. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Right there. There's the cleaning. Is that good? Okay, repair is done. Cleaning's done. Walls, floors, ceilings. I mean, you gotta give it like a beachy vibe, right? You gotta give it a beachy vibe. You have a fever. Oh, I didn't realize you had a fever. Oh my god, hopefully you kick that fever. Fevers are no fun. Absolutely no fun. Let's see. Give me a beachy vibe. Okay, you know what? No. First things first, we get lights in here. Give me lights. The lights came a freaking action. Oh, I gotta keep an eye on the time. I gotta keep an eye on the time because I cannot miss the trader life. Uh, stream <laughs> i can't miss my own stream that would be bad i'm gonna go for like light wood light wood i think that's light yeah it's light a bit better to find the broken bits than building simulator 
was watching you lay hide and seek with that yesterday. <laughs> yeah. Sometimes uh, certain games just don't give it to you. They don't give you the, the obvious answer. Right? Sometimes we need the obvious answer. Got some people walking in. Say hi to Danielle when she gets back tomorrow. Y'all have a good one. Have a good one, Hoppy. Do take care. Absolutely. Thanks for hanging out with us too as well. Yeah, I, you know, Danielle's going to be coming back tomorrow. Hopefully. <laughs> I mean, I say hopefully, but she won't be back till like midnight tomorrow. I got to go pick her up and all that good stuff, but it won't be till late tomorrow night. So we'll get some freaking dinkum in tomorrow. This reminds me of House Flipper. Facts. I agree. Kind of feels like it. <clears throat> left side railing, fifth, six from left. Wait, what? A left side? Uh, this six left. Fifth, six. Oh, yeah, that one. Yeah, I think that one's just, uh, might be bugged or something. Or the lighting's weird, but I can't do anything to that one. Oh, gosh. One? Is it this one? Yeah, there we go. You missed it the other day. Why change now? You know, next time, you know what? There's going to be a day, Jefferson. There's going to be a day that you miss. You ready for it? There's going to be a day you miss your Friday night Jackbox party. And when you do... I will be there to remind you <laughs> for the rest of your life. <laughs> I bet the giveaway. Uh, yeah, the giveaway, the people that won the giveaway for the Trader Life, they were definitely happy. They were like, and one of the cool things I liked about it was like, people were like, oh my God, I'd never win anything. And I won. Like, yeah, you did. Like, I can't believe I won. I never win anything. And I know that feeling. I know that feeling. That is not indoor flooring. Looking for beach. Can I just throw sand in here? Will that be okay? Ugh. Awful. Also awful. That's better. Yeah, I like that. I think I could get down with that. It's like a tile, but like a, like, you know, a sandy colored tile. Kind of matches the upstairs, matches the drapes. <laughs> Something rather, I don't know. Sign of a good game that you lose, uh, lose time, uh, lose track of time. It's either a good game or it's just, I have a good chat conversation like i have a good good bunch of people here that like to talk nonsense with me because for the most part 90 percent of the stuff that comes out of my mouth is nonsense but yeah you know absolutely you know what's something we haven't done we haven't like mixed and matched like flooring patterns or stuff or like ceiling patterns or oh god ceiling patterns or things like that uh, da, 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 da. Oh, you watch the Game Awards? Yeah, dude. During the Game Awards, all I did, I was going to watch it. And then, like, I was like, oh, I got my desk that day. And I was like, F it. I'm not going to watch it. <laughs> I'm just going to build my desk. That took forever. But I heard it was okay. I heard it was okay. I saw Game of the Year was not Hades, which was wrong. So there's that for you. Kind of like this. Wait a sec. Wait, whoa, 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 what was that? It was wallpaper, wasn't it? Wallpaper? Oh, do they not want the walls done? <gasps> oh, frick. Oh, they don't want the walls done? They already have the walls done? No, it says walls, floor, ceiling. Do they not want that one, then? Walls? Maybe these walls? I don't want these walls. Uh oh. That's not right either. Literally everyone in chat asks why I was watching the f 
Big ass game awards. <laughs> um, let's go paint. Can I do any of that? I can't do any of that. Oh man, what the heck? It must be bugged out. Probably is bugged out. Nonetheless, we will uh continue on. Game of the year, uh, one was what was it? The Last of Us Part Two. That was the game of the year, and that's what won, right? Correct me if I'm wrong. How many of these kitchen tables? Three kitchen tables? Uh, F. That's crazy. There's a big debate in the gaming world, and maybe people want to kind of go in on this. We top it for a discussion. Um, there's two types of uh, people, right? Uh, two types. Not two types of people, but two types of, like, perspectives, I guess. Um... Game of the year. Does game of the year... Oh, game of the year was Elden Ring? Okay, then. Okay, good. Good. All right. I just... <laughs> I said la the, the Last of Us Part 2 because I was like... <laughs> I was like, oh, you know, just throw out there. Maybe uh, maybe something will stick. Maybe I'll get it right. <laughs> uh, anyways. But, um... I'm glad I wasn't right. But, um... <laughs> correct me if I'm wrong. Of course... I'm so glad I wasn't correct. I'm so glad I was corrected wrong there. Because that would have been something. Anyways. Um, there's people out there that think a game has to come out in the same year for it to win game of the year. Do people believe in that? Who's on the side of a game doesn't have to come out the same year to be game of the year? I know both sides of the arguments, right? I honestly don't care. I just think if a game is good, then a game is good that year, you know? I don't think it necessarily... I mean, I, I don't know. I understand the arguments, though. So, like, the, th the theory is, is that people are like, if the game doesn't come out in 2022, then it can't be 2022 game of the year. There we go. It depends on the qualifiers that come with the game of the year award. What do you mean by that? The qualifiers. As in like what other games came out that year? Is that what you mean? That would determine whether or not a game can win game of the year. There we go. No, I feel like that's cockeyed. Is that cockeyed? That's yeah, a little bit cockeyed. Hang on, so let's move, move this out of the way. There we go. That's better. My game of the year video is about games I played this year, therefore it's not limited to this year. Okay, okay, yeah. Yeah, that, 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 that's, that's, I, I feel like that's, that's a good thing. Yeah, 100%. I like that. I feel like if there's a game that captivates an entire audience in the year, I think that it deserves game of the year, whether it was like an early access title that, you know, came out whenever, or maybe a game that came out, it doesn't have to be early access. It could be a game that came out two years ago that people are like, oh, I had no idea this game existed until bam, it, it existed, you know, type thing. Two refrigerators? God, this place is going to look disgusting with all the, I, th I feel like these missions here are like too much, too much, uh, too much nonsense. Too much kitchen stuff. Especially for, like, the size of the cafe. Like, the cafe doesn't need all this kitchen equipment for, like, two seats. You know what I mean? I might be able to slide that in right there. Maybe not. Put a deep fryer next to a fridge, I know. Disgusting, right? I can see the logic for both sides of the argument. You can apply them to music. Yeah. Which changed when they applied it all around all to every every download. Yeah, I I I, I don't know how they project winning. Honestly, you could say uh the companies that pay to win the awards, you know. <laughs> we could we could say all that. I don't know. Like there there could be that, there could not be that. I don't know. I'm not going into a giant conspiracy theory rabbit hole. But um, from an outside just looking in, you know, it's like, 
integrity, I guess. Integrity is, is a good word to use. Integrity. You expect them to use integrity. Hey, Damien. How's it going, Damien? How you doing? Hey, Mr. Rabbit. How's it going, Mr. Rabbit? Shout out to India. Yeah, how you doing? The real BS is that Valve is working on the Steam Deck 2 before releasing the first one in Australia. What? Well... First of all, I didn't know they were ma making Steam Deck, another Steam Deck, right? That, that's what I'll say first of all. Second of all, I'm trying to think of like handheld devices. Handheld de devices that came out, um, that came out, right? And then that came out with like, or even consoles. It could be consoles too. It could be consoles that came out and then, um, you know, like a Nintendo Switch and then like a Nintendo Switch Lite, or, you know, like a revamp so to speak, or like the Xbox 360 and then the Xbox 360 Slim or the PlayStation 3 or the PlayStation 3 Slim or whatever the hell they did, like variations of the consoles to kind of improve things that might have went wrong with the uh, flagship, you know, uh, initial console, you know what I'm talking about. Those things, maybe, I don't know. Cabinets. But I did not know the Steam Deck is not in Australia yet. Is that true? I did not know that was a fact. Why is that? I have no idea why. Okay, ice cream machine still going to be self-served. Hey, Care Bear, how you doing? Sorry, I just said Care Bear. What the fuck is wrong with me? Carrie, how you doing, Carrie? Good to see you. I apologize for being an absolute a-hole. Messing up that. Hey, Cool Gaming, how you doing? Sorry. <laughs> I woke up. I so I woke up in the middle of the night and I couldn't go back to sleep. I couldn't. I woke up in the middle of the night. I'm like, first of all, Danielle's not here. And when you don't like, when you don't have like a, uh, you know, when you, when you sleep with someone by your side for like almost 10 years, it's, it's hard to get used to not having someone sleeping by your side. Even though, you know, Bless her, she does snore. Like I miss the, I miss that. <laughs> I miss the occasional, the the uh, you know, the occasional uh, swing of a punch as I as she tosses over. You know, <laughs> she's a heavy sleeper. She is. I will not put the outhouse right there. This will go outside. They come in vampire survivors were criminally neglected. Vant vampire sires survivors made a huge impact for a $2 game. I agree. I agree. I think Vampire uh, Survivors also is coming out with DLC. But I don't think a game classifies to be game of the year if it's in early access. So I don't think Dinkum would be that. I think Vampire Survivors, though, is out of early access. Employee of the month doesn't have to be hired that month. Facts. There you go. That's a great way to put it. That's a good way to put it. Employee of the month starting what is that? Dane Cook, Jessica Simpson. There's a movie for you. Cash register. Yeah, like there. I'll move that if I need to. Yeah, I'll move that if I need to. Hey, Lou Mind, how you doing, Lou Mind? Mario Rabbids? I didn't see any of that. Good thing I didn't watch it, right? I don't know. I was going to do a reaction, and I was like, ah, I got to take Danielle to the airport, F. And then when I got back, I was like, ah, I'm going to, like, I got back from taking her to the airport. It was already, like, halfway over. I'm like, I'm not going to watch it now. I'm going to build my desk now. Five tables? Are you out of your damn mind? Five tables? I guess we'll go modern. Somebody's going to sit next to the somebody that's you know, trying to make a chocolate swirl. Maybe not. Hey, Hellboy, how you doing? New subscriber here, just wanted to jump on and say hi. Been at our Christmas parade. Found your channel a few weeks ago. Oh, very good. Very good. How you doing, Hellboy? Thanks for uh, stopping by and saying hello, and uh, thanks for subscribing. I appreciate it. Yeah. 
Hope you're doing good. This works. People used to call you Care Bear? Oh, F. <laughs> Did I bring back flashbacks? <laughs> there we go. Look too bad. What do we need next? Lamps. Lamps. Hey, sister soul, sister soul, sister soul, sister. Soul, sister. Hey, sister. I, there was, the song came on in the TV. Somebody's watching Everybody Loves Raymond. I think the pigs are. Can you put a new floor on the porch? Let's try. I don't know if you can actually put outdoor flooring. Can you? Oh, baby, you can. Look at that. All right, I'm going to do that here last. Good shout. Maybe that's what it wants us to do, the flooring outside. Ah ha ha, I like it. Hey Leanne, how you doing? Steam Deck is probably not in Australia because Aussies have a very restrictive attitude towards games, so not so it's not going to be a priority market. <laughs> what the frick did you just say? What are you talking about? I, the only thing I know about Australia is I know Australia is like... I know they have a very, like, legitimate restriction on internet access, right? Not, like, accessing the internet, but, like, more of, like, um, what is it? Like, internet speeds? Maybe, maybe even access on internet, too. But, like, I know internet speeds, I think, if I remember correctly, are, like, they're regulated, right? It's like internet is regulated a little bit differently in Australia, I, I believe. I believe. I believe. It'll get bright in here. Very bright. The core. I will go for the winter theme now. I will not go for the winter theme. Okay, I will go for the winter theme. There we go. Winter theme there. And a... Frickin' meadow, maybe. Is there a beach vibe? No beaches? No beach vibe. Um, I'll go for freaking the stairs that. Oh my goodness gracious! Sick dude. <clears throat> Christopher Judge won for dad of dad of boy two and gave the slowest speech ever. I'm pretty sure he cost them a lot of extra steam decks. Uh, Christopher Judge. Are we talking about Christopher Judge? As in like. Was he the same guy? He was. No, that was Christopher Lloyd. Never mind. I don't know who Christopher Judge is. <laughs> nope. Um, let's put an arcade outside, I guess. Can we do that? It'd be a bad idea to put an arcade outside, but whatever. Terrible idea, especially right on the beach. Not for thievery problems, but also for like for humidity problems. Box right there too. Okay, let's do the flooring. Stargate God of War. One episode of Maguire. Def Jam Vendetta. Everything you just said, no idea. God of War, even no idea on that too. Sorry to break hearts there. <laughs> That's the light of 10 suns, I know. <laughs> kind of crazy. I'm gonna go hardwood. Um, I'm going to go light wood. Give me light wood. I might have lost subscribers there where I said I have not uh, done God of War. I'm just saying, like, I have not played God of War, okay? I grew up mostly with Xbox, and... I mean, my brother had a PlayStation. We had a PlayStation then, but... Then somebody stole our PlayStation. When we stole our PlayStation 3 right out of our house. That kind of sucked. So, no God of War for me. How we doing now? Walls and ceilings and floors. See, I don't know what the heck they want from me. I, I probably will say F them. We'll call this complete. Hang on, let's look at it real quick. 
It looks decent. No? It looks decent. It has to look decent. I just feel like the game says to add way too much than we need to. But that's all right. $8,000 is good. Fast food burgers. Burgers. Put the pizza away now. Selling just burgers. Hamburger double... <laughs> Cheeseburger, hamburger, double cheeseburger, put me with the Big Mac and the chicken burger. What the hell is a chicken burger? Maybe a chicken sandwich is what they mean. The $8 burger. The $12 cheeseburger. The $11 Big Mac. Cheeseburger is more expensive than the Big Mac. I know, right? Food stuff. Patties. That's it. All we need. Pet the cat. Yeah, the light color would would does would work on the beach. Yeah. Uh, no, 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 no. Give me this. <clears throat> so what i was gonna say is i'm gonna actually get rid of this and add a second person let's see let's see what happens when i do that ah you can't have more than two well f me sideways that sucks all right so that's as that's as best that we can get okay well then let's bring this in at least so we can stop oh that is an outside toy only ah Outside toy only. Frick, man. All right. All right, well, we just lost on, out on that. I guess let's move this. We'll move that. I don't want to rebuy it. Like right there. They'll do. That will do, Piggot. That will do. The bans don't apply to Steam, though. Only physical copies. Oh, physical copies of games, right? Not digital digital copies, yeah. Like that. And then let's go a decor. I don't know where I would get a plant. That's where I get a plant. There we go. That's better. Let's go to a management. We will pay. Work speed. Everything else sucks. Okay. Oh, we have a lot of skill points, too. On Steam games that are banned, just show as unclassified. Interesting. Do I need tomatoes? Let's see. Uh, I don't need tomatoes for any of the burgers, which is weird. But I have 19 of them, but I don't need them, I guess. Put the... That away. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, you know what I should do too? I'll show you. We have twenty thousand dollars, so we're looking pretty good. We'll go. Your staff will be able to suggest additional. Yeah, we'll do the additional. We'll do the speed. We'll do those two. Now we max out our speed to like the best. What I'm gonna do now? Add a logo. Yeah. I will add the Harry Shooter. Wait. Korzov Pub. We're only missing one pub. This, what is that? Manhattan or something pub? I don't even know what the hell that is. Oh, yeah, I could get another chef. Yeah, I could definitely get another chef. That might be help me out with speed, too. Coffee Sky looks like it's cyberpunk. I feel like I need to go with the Harry Shooter. Yeah. I'm just going to grab a snack. Forgot... Which stream I was watching. <laughs> hey, Samira, how you doing? I thought you meant ep one episode of MacGyver was banned. Oh. <laughs> the 
the Peppa Pig is a bad influence? Dude, the Peppa Pig be hitting different. <laughs> we gotta see what this looks like. Yo, look at that. It's the Harry Shooter. That sounds like a possible parody of a possible adult film there. But hey, look at there's Harry Shoot Shotter. Sorry, Harry Shotter, not Shooter. Harry Shotter. Okay, now that may be like sounds like a mistake made in his pants. Regardless, we have it. We got it. Nice. And we should have enough money for the uh, terrace, right? Terrace. Uh, my restaurant. 16,000. We have barely just enough to get the second floor in, which we will unlock. $200 left over. We still need to get $2,000, I think, from the uh, Bigfoot. Still need to get that. Let's go ahead and take a look at this now. Oh, baby. Look at all that. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Okay, I would not... Okay, so... Australia, not because, well, the flight is long. Would I ever go to Australia? Okay, look, you have to convince me to get on a long flight. I need to be at the most comfort that I possibly can. Second of all, you need to get rid of your spiders. Then maybe I'll come. Look at that. We got the terrace. Hooray! Flynn's is from Tron. Is that what it's from? Harry Shotter in the chamber of BDSM. Perfect. <laughs> oh, perfect. Absolutely perfect. <laughs> How the hell did you get a shopping cart up here? No, no, I got this. It's fine. I got it, dude. It's fine. No, 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 no. I got it. I got it. I got it. I think we have one more mission. I think the game has to give us one more mission if we need to unlock the logo, maybe, or the last uh, sign, I think. I think purple goes well with Harry Shotter. I'll be real with you. This will be the Love Terrace. The Love Terrace of the Harry Shotter. 100%. We will remove garbage again. And then all we need to do is sell 15 burgers, and then after the 15 burgers, we need to sell 15 sushis. And then we need to hire another uh, kitchen person because I think having another chef would really help us out with our queue. Yes, the 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 um, yeah, it will help out, help us out with the queue. Yeah, <laughs> that's what it is. Very well. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you don't you don't want to come to America. Stay in Australia. You're you're fine. You're fine. You're not missing much over here. I promise. I I'm missing everything over there. I'm missing everything at in Australia. I'm missing like random kangaroos walking down the street in somebody's neighborhood. That's what I'm missing. There you go. At that. All right. Cool. I like it. All right. I think overall, I don't want to lose track of time here, obviously. I don't want to lose track of time for our next stream. But I think this is going to be a good resting stop. We did make it to uh, level 10. Good. We did also get the last place upstairs, the terrace. We still need to get the uh, Bigfoot check. Um, we will sell 15 food to get $250, which will help fund our terrace upstairs. We also need to get, well, after this, we'll probably have to do sushi as well. 15 things of sushi, which is fine. It's easy to do. Then we will be able to make this romantic terrace and have what we, you know, I think we'll probably finish this up here very soon. Yeah, very soon. Indeed. Yeah. How you doing, Taylor? So we're going to stop it right here, but we're going to be back here in like 15 minutes. I'm going to go ahead and take a bite real quick, uh, get, get a little snack, and then we're going to be back onto some Trader Life Simulator as well. Uh, so we're going to be diving into that, but, uh, yes, I'm very happy with the progress that we made just to kind of remind people today's stream and probably the next stream for, uh, if we do another next stream, probably we will. I mean, it depends really if you want to do another stream with this, uh, with cafe, you know, owner simulator, hit the like button, uh, definitely do that. And then I'll finish it off here and we'll do all that good stuff. But 
Today, stream in today's stream is not a full representation of the game. Just know that I am playing on a older build, and the reason why I'm playing on an older build is strictly because uh, I lost my entire save file when the game released to the public. So there was an update for the public. Uh, well, when the game released to the public, the game came with an update. That update erased in my entire save file, so I had to go back to an older. Um, older version and that's what i'm on now so bugs and things performance wise you see in these streams are probably different from uh, when you played the game so just know that uh so anyways thank you all i'm gonna go get a snack we'll be back with some trader life simulator 2 because we have sammy building our parking lot and things like that so hopefully y'all will join me with that thank you all it's been a pleasure and honor being with you today and i will see you here in a short short minute all right so thank you see you soon